Hi guys, welcome back to my channel if you're new here. I'm Emma and I'm doing like a little mini night in my life. So as you saw in like the clips before this, I was walking home. Well, you didn't know I was walking home, but I was walking home. I got my nails done at Mini Lux. It looks blue on camera and like a little hint of purple, but I think it's supposed to be gray, but like it has like purple undertones. I don't know. Anyway, I got my nails done and because I'm going on a trip actually in a few. So I got home from that and it's been hours since. Clearly it's dark outside. And I watched Gossip Girl for like two hours. So that's like what happens when it comes to this time of year. I All I do is watch Gossip Girl. And I'm not complaining about it, but I'm also kind of complaining about it because like... I literally did nothing and I'm over here trying to do a night in my life where I'm actually doing stuff But I watched Gossip Girl for like half of it and then I made dinner and I had pasta So that was good. But anyway, I'm getting ready right now. I'm gonna put on a little bit of makeup I'm going to this place with Gretchen and Brooke and then we are going to the Whoa, this light is so bright. And then we are going to um, the BU hockey game. Oh my gosh, I'm so cold. It's very cold outside. But I need my phone because I need Gretchen to be able to text me. I don't even feel like putting on makeup either. Because when I get cold and I put makeup on, it gets like, you know, crusty. <laughs> Not like crusty, that sounds disgusting. It gets just like, mm, weird. A sweater. Gretchen, she just told me to wear a sweater. She's FaceTiming me. Hi. Oh, you look so cute. I just got in the shower and I threw on a sweater. I know. Oh I my God. Brooke was like, Uber. I'm like, uh-huh. Oh, really? You're in the Uber right now? But like, whatever. She lives far, so it takes her. Really yeah, long. that's what I was assuming. Because at first, when you said um, that she was, when you said 6.30, I thought you meant that she was going to be here by 6.30. Yeah. I was like, well, you but know she's what? Like on her way, but like we have a minute. <laughs> oh, good, because I literally just started to put makeup on. Yeah. Just so totally I want to wear like yoga pants and like a jacket. What jacket? Like a pu a puffy coat. No, you literally can. Like who cares? You know, I have jeans and a sweater, but I'm gonna put on a puffy coat. Yeah. Oh, okay. I was gonna put on a bomber, but I'm literally gonna put on like a puffa. No, I'm putting on a puffa, like a full puffa. Like Gretchen, it's cold. It's 30 degrees. Yeah. And oh my god, I need to blow dry my hair right now. And like, no one's going out because no one's here this weekend. I was like, why is there? Wait, yeah. Why isn't anyone here? Brooke told me that um because it's a holiday it's weekend. Day. Um. Okay. Yeah. yeah. I'll run over soon. Okay. I'll see you in the lobby. All right. Bye. Okay. Bye. Way to the game just an hour late fashionably late that's fine right that's how you want <laughs> that's how we do it that's how we do it over here in boston <laughs> um but yeah i feel like i was talking about this when i was putting my makeup on that when it's cold outside and i have my makeup on for a while my makeup gets crusty yeah like dry because <laughs> they are so cold yeah but um anyway we're gonna go sit in the cold ring for the game hopefully there's a lot of people because i feel like it makes it less cold that's true. Yeah. You know, you know a lot of people cold. going. Honestly, I don't even know who they're playing. Like if it was like a BUBC <laughs> game, it would be they're like playing, packed. Yeah. Do you know they're who they're playing? playing? PC, Providence College. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, I don't know. I feel like it'll just be like normal, <laughs> like a couple, like medium-sized crowd. Not like no one, but not like a lot. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> the player shrunk. I don't know what happened. The they literally shrunk. <laughs> Where do they go? Look at them. Oh, and I just got home and I am so tired. I also just got out of the shower and I look like a mess, but um, I'm doing my skincare right now and I need to brush my hair. I should really do that first because it looks so bad. But I have a new skincare. I really like it and it's so good. My skin has been feeling so clear, like clean and clear. Um, and just the one thing though is that I wore makeup tonight so my skin's like acting up in some spots. So I'm gonna have to use, oh yeah, like right there. I'm gonna have to use um, my pimple patches, but I told you guys I would tell you guys about them since they've been working really well. And I like have been trying them out for like 
almost like a little bit more than a week. Um, no, not more than a week, a little bit more than like, it's almost been a month. It's been like three weeks and they work so well. And you guys need to use them. So I'll probably tell you more about them in the morning just cause I'm so tired right now. so I went to bed right and I fell asleep and like I was having such a good sleep and then at like 1 30 in the morning I wake up to like this alarm going off and it like wasn't my phone but we have like see that red thing yeah it like has an alarm it's like an alarm system in case there's like an emergency like a fire or mostly just like a fire but the last night was weird so um the alarm started to go off and it like woke everyone up, it woke Maggie up, it woke her boyfriend up, me up, like I mean obviously it was gonna wake you up, it was so loud and like annoying and I was like laying there and I was like oh my god, like no, like I was having the best sleep. So then I like tried to fall back to sleep but like it was so annoying <laughs> and then Maggie was like no like we need to go downstairs. So basically we had to like all just like leave and go into the elevator. Well, normally you have to take the stairs, but I don't think it was a fire. I think just someone like accidentally pulled the fire alarm at 1 a.m. And um, we all had to sit down in the lobby and wait for like the firemen to like go up there and check it out. It was just like, I was so tired, but I still have my pimple patches on my face. And that's like basically what I wanted to come on here and talk to you guys about was those so i'm gonna sit down and tell you guys about them because i've been using them and the company actually reached out to work with me and i was like so excited because it's something that like i really really like and i think that really works so i just want to tell you guys about them sorry i look so rough right now but these are the pimple patches and they're by the brand glam up um but they have 18 patches and it has okay basically this is so cool because it has two technically three types of patches in it and i'll show it to you is this a new pack yeah i hope this is a new pack because i have one of my packs that's like almost empty and i don't want to be showing you guys that one yeah this one's new so well i used it but it has the four well six little patches and then it has six big patch patches and then these ones are so cool. These ones are like micro needle patches, so they look a little bit different. And they have like this little, um, I want to show it to you guys. It's so cool. I have no clue if you can see it, but like it has these little like micro needles in it. And I've never seen a pimple patch like that before, and they, it honestly works so well. At first, I was so scared because I was like, micro needle, like, what is that gonna do? But it's so smart having one of those as a pimple patch so i'm gonna like read it off the back for you so this is before the pimple becomes irritated and this is when you use the micro needling patch and it says this targets trouble spot and acne early quickly and easily micro needling patches contain soothing and calming ingredients um to help clarify the troubled skin so the micro needling patch you use it obviously after you cleanse your face you put on dry skin press for 10 seconds leave it on for two to three hours or i left it on for overnight so i don't know i just feel like i always do pimple patches at night and then leave it on overnight so i literally have had it on for like eight hours and then it tells you all the ingredients and then the patches that i showed you guys like these ones the just normal circle ones um are the they calm and block pimple discoloration so I like should be using that. I should have put that on this one, but 
and these ones but um i have been putting it on these ones for like a few like probably a week and they cleared up so at first it was like this one was like a hard ball so was this one and then this one has been here for so long and i put it on these and it, they literally feel like just normal skin now which is so crazy because nothing else works but yeah so that's basically what these do you guys can get them on amazon and amazon prime they have them for amazon prime also but it's just so easy like you just order them on amazon i will have it all like linked down below for you guys because they work so well and i get a lot of questions about clear skin and how i keep my skin clear and i used to never use pimple patches but now i do and they are like life changing they are also super affordable oh my god guys so i just looked them up and i found them on amazon so they do have them for amazon prime so you can get them tomorrow which is sick i can't believe amazon does that anyway um it's only like nine dollars for one pack of 18 18 for a pack of 36 35 for 72 wow um in 27 for 54 so it gives you all these great deals and you get so many and you literally only i mean like at least for me i use them like once in a while and it like really clears up my skin like i have this little one on my i'm gonna like take it off to see how it feels um but i don't know they're just like different than pimple patches i've used okay yeah i had like a little bump right here on my skin and it went away it's completely gone and then the ones oh, I'm so sorry about how i look right now i like maybe should wash not wash but brush my hair before i do this um and then the ones on my forehead i put there because i wore makeup last night and whenever i wear makeup my skin always breaks out because it's just not used to it and um i had a little mini pimple there and it's completely gone and then this one i had like a few little mini pimples and they're gone like why is this like magical <laughs> and then this one it's gone too okay cool um but yeah it's so funny and it, these when you put them on you can't really see them on it kind of just like blends into your face and last night during the um the fire alarm they like people i obviously saw a lot of people and i feel like they either like saw that i had little circles on my face but like you couldn't really tell so like that was cool too i don't know i've literally gone to a workout class with these on before which probably isn't good but anyway i need to get up i have a workout class with gretchen at 9 30. it's 9 08 oh my god wait i need to see if she's up if she's not up then i'm going back to bed okay i'm gonna get ready for workout class <laughs> Way shut when the fire alarm goes off. Oh my god. Just leaving Sculpt and it was so funny because Gretchen and I got in there. Wait, I need to fix this. We got in there kind of like right when it was starting and there's this little, little spot in the corner. For and our mat. match, yes, our mats were touching because it was meant for one mat, but we like squeezed two in it and we were so close. Yeah. Look who just snapchatted me. What? what? Together. Why? Of course. He knows. Yeah. Oh my god. So we had an intimate yoga morning. It was, we were so. We were in our own little world. <laughs> and we were just like sitting there like. And that was the hardest goal to It was so life. hard. She Mind even you. said, she started, she was like, this is going to be a hard one. And we were like, we come into this, we're like, oh, we're just going to chill. Like, I'm going to use three pound weights today. Like, I'm going to have a good day. Yeah. No, <laughs> but it was good class. Yeah. I enjoyed it. Cleaner came and look. They put a little rose on our toilet paper. Everything's so clean. It literally feels like brand new. Oh, wow. It's so clean. It's so clean in here. Wow. It feels so clean. It literally like sorry it's so dark in my room maybe i'll like try to turn the brightness up and that didn't work at all but um i just finished
finished packing, which is so insane because guess what time it is? It's currently 6.40. Normally when I pack for going on trips, I like finish packing maybe around like three hours before we leave and then I get like four hours, no, <laughs> but I get like three hours of sleep and then it's like really bad. Um, so yeah, I'm going on a trip right now and I, again, just finished packing. So I like have everything laid out. I'm gonna like probably eat dinner and go to bed early just cause we have to get up so early. Our flight is at like 4 a.m. I'm so just not, I hate early flights. Like if flights were like later on in the morning, it's perfectly fine, but early, early flights, I just don't understand why. Anyway, um, I'm gonna go to bed, not now, but like soon, obviously. So I'm just gonna like end off this vlog here. And if you guys wanna see my videos for my trip and everything like that, just keep on watching my videos but yeah so thank you guys so much for watching and i'll see you guys in my next video bye everyone